Hey, Sam. Ryder, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is when Alec first learned the initiative. It will be just a moment. Hello, Alec. I'm too old for Cloak and Dagger. I got your message. I'm here. Who are you? A benefactor, if you like. You have something to offer me? A future. That's vague. A future for your wife. You're out of money. Your contacts have dried up. You can't finish there. How do you know about... I can help you. Whatever you need. Start by telling me what you need. Your AI is more than a cure for your wife. It could also be the salvation for many others. I don't follow. Where we're going, we'll need a different perspective to understand things. Where's that? The Andromeda Galaxy? I have a proposal for you. And Ellen doesn't have much time. Are you interested? Who was that? The Benefactor? I believe there was more to the Andromeda Initiative than was publicly understood. Private logs are now available in your father's quarters. They may shed further light on the matter. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. Thanks, Sam. That's all for now. Of course. Your father's personal logs. I had a strange meeting yesterday. I thought it would be with Jien Garson, who founded the initiative. But it wasn't. I guess Jien's the visionary, the one who gets everyone excited about the project and drums up publicity. But then this benefactor apparently provides resources and money. And I mean a lot of money. It's a little unusual. But everything about this project is... Interesting. I wonder if Director Tan knows anything about this. Worth talking to him. Probably doesn't. I accepted the initiative's offer. They're calling me a Pathfinder. <laughs> There's no other option left. Sam will never happen without their help. Our savings are gone, and no one will return my calls. I am a pariah. There's something strange going on with this benefactor. But Ellen's getting worse. I can't fail her. You won't. Okay, let's speak with Director Tan about it. Wrong way. Hey, PB. Where are you? Still not spending time in the Nexus, huh? No, I made the rounds. Tons more people milling about. My old apartment's been appropriated. Guess they need the space. You seem sad about that. Not sad, exactly. Guess I just realized how nice it was to have a quiet place where I could disappear. Now, everywhere you go, boom, people. Yeah, people are everywhere. Hey, uh, just hanging out. People on the Nexus recognize me and know I fly with you. Don't like all this here. Well, imagine how it must be for me then. Okay, uh, management, operations. As sleepers wake from stasis, the initiative urgently requires blood, tissue, and DNA donations. Medic, if you think you may be eligible, this is Agent S. All right. So first off, I kind of want to see if there is any uh, new strike missions. Still an hour and fifty-two minutes. That's an hour and forty-seven, and that's fifteen minutes. Okay. So Director Tan. Hello, Aid. Hi, Cora. Hey, I don't know. You 
need more man. water? That won't grow plants any faster. They'll drown. Well, you're a botanist. There must be a way. We need higher yields. Patience, Tan. That's the one thing we can least afford. There is no time. Lives depend on you. Something I can help you with? I'm curious. What do you know about the people who backed the initiative? What everyone knows. Gian Carson was the founder and visionary. Unfortunately, she died on the Nexus during the Scourge disaster. Is there anyone else? I would almost welcome them. A voice to silence the rabble. Then Cash might listen. But no, we're alone. Why do you ask? I have information that suggests Garson wasn't the only one. What sort of information? It's complicated, but there was a silent partner. A benefactor. Even if that were true, we've been here 14 months with no sign of them. This partner is either a phantom, missing, or dead. No, Gian Garson was the beacon. A sad end to someone of such stature. Dying alone. Oh? It was chaos. By the time they found her, she was already dead. Succumbed to her injuries. That's some kind of luck. Dying after a 600-year trip she organized personally? No one ever said fate is kind. If you're suggesting something else happened, Ryder, I'd rather you didn't. Let's not add to the confusion. Thank you for your time. Ryder, if you wish to pursue this further, accessing Nexus security records may reveal more information. So maybe she didn't die, uh, with the accident. So what, what happened? I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued now. Okay. What are we looking for, Sam? Any information relating to Gene Carson's death? Uh, missing person report, Jay Garson. Andromeda initially found Regina Garson was reported missing. She was last seen during the emergency stasis revival that occurred after the scourge encounter. A bulletin has been issued. Uh, update to the missing persons report filed on Jean Garson. Maintenance crew found her body in an ex's apartment. Severe burns were apparent, similar to others we saw who were killed during the Scourge disaster. It's unclear how she got there, but confusion and disorientation during the Scourge event are likely. Events aligned with the timeline. Cause of death, casualty of Scourge disaster. Case closed. Affairs, hmm. The only hard fact is that her body was found in one of the apartments. Then connecting her death to the Scourge disaster was mere speculation. Yeah, they just wanted this to go away. I think we need to check out that apartment. Environmental data will allow us to reconstruct the scene. This is awesome. How's the pathfinding? Good? I'll let you get back to work. Okay, hold up. I'm gonna try something else. Uh, let's go to resources. Let's press X. Nope, doesn't do anything. Maybe it hasn't loaded yet. Maybe I still need to wait. Or maybe I... It just glitched out. I don't know. Docking bait. An expedition to Eos in the Pythia system has discovered a mysterious facility that authorities are calling a vault. Though not much yet is known about the underground structure, it's believed to be remnant in origin. Noted the sorry scientist, Pelisaria Basail. What we activated in the vault drastically improved the atmosphere on Eos. This is HNS. This is where Jean Garson's body was discovered. What are we looking for? If you scan the room, environmental data may allow for scene recreation. Somebody killed her. There. This was no accident. She was murdered. As this incident occurred over a year ago, her killer is likely far away by now. Yeah. But, wait. This whole area was shuttered back then. Didn't open until the Hyperion arrived. So what was Garson even doing here? Perhaps a further scan of the room is in order. What is this? A hidden door. What do we have here? Uh, 2179 once mentioned a storm is coming. Said evidence was clear. Meaning, Andromeda, why? Hyperion, still low contact. Where is Alec? Did they get him too? What? The 
This is Gian Garson. I don't have much time. I've been hiding in the sealed off sections of the Nexus since we got here. Someone's trying to kill me. And now I can hear them down in the hydroponics area. They're coming. I've embedded what I know in my VI in the cultural center. This log has the code. And whatever happens... Oh god, they're outside the door. Wow, this is some serious shit. Yes, deeply troubling. I have the code you mentioned for the VI kiosk. What the hell happened? I thought she died in an accident, like, tragically, but now I'm not so sure. Who was it? Hello there, neighbor. I'm Gian Garson, the founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I thought you might like to hear more about our plans. Sam, can we hear that message Garson talked about? Unlocking it now. Rerouting to our private channel. For years, there was a silent partner involved with the initiative. The truth is, I was running out of money. Then a benefactor stepped in. I didn't ask questions. I never met them face to face. That was a mistake. I lied to everyone. Something big spooked them in the Milky Way, and now they're moving a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. I hope it's all for the good, but... I have my doubts. And now I think they're going to remove me. Alec Ryder and I had a code word for this. Bulkrum. He may have learned more. What did that mean? Something big in the Milky Way. Perhaps your father's locked memories hold the answer. I'm he might have known more. Yeah. Guess I'll have to keep unlocking them to find out for sure. The Reapers, so they... Hello there, neighbor. I'm Gian Garson, the founder of the Andro... Okay. But I want to put your mind at ease. So... Somebody was spooked of the Reapers, and like, what? Holy hell, I have a lot of aluminium now. And try to evacuate a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. Good plan, but where the hell did I kill Garson? Hey, Jal, anything you want to say? How's the cultural study going, Jal? What the hell? Read up on the Elcor Hamlet yet? Yes. I think the performance certainly elevated the source material. Did you know that PB's father was an Elcor? No. Shalom. That is my favorite human greeting. Th this is the first time I hear of it. Was Fulcrum. All systems green. Good. Any emails? No. So let me see if I go over here and press X. Nope, still nothing. So maybe it just glitched out? Because last two times it just it allowed me to go here and press X and I would be done. How about uh, Andromeda Viability and now if I press X? Nope. No, so I do need to return to AVP status control. So how long does it take for that? 30 minutes and 45 minutes for those. Got it. That's dumb. Instead of giving me more, you make me wait less. 219. That's a good amount. Uh, what should I go with now? S oh, sorry, sword. Definitely. Max it out. Anything here? No. And no. Okay, so only one thing left to do, and Half that center. is... You have pending vid calls. Uh, first off, we're gonna save, though, because... Paranoia. Efra de Tershav. 
Commander. Pathfinder, Joel's been keeping me updated on your adventures, your good deeds on our behalf. I meant them. I want you to know you can trust me. You rescued Shabbat Khan. His loss would have been hard for the Resistance. But your true agenda is clear, to explore Aya's vault. Jarl says you want to help find the Moshai. Why should I let you? I'd like this to be the beginning of a strong relationship. Keep your promises and little by little our bond might grow. We've managed to trace the Moshai to a special catch facility on Vold. Why special? These facilities are protected by a dynamic shield tech we haven't been able to crack. We're close, but its ability to adapt outstrips the speed of our current processors. Pathfinder, adding my processor to that program would no doubt make the difference. Ephra, I can help. Respectfully, this time you need my help. Respectfully, the Angara don't need anything from you. We take care of our own. What I meant was, let our scientists help with your program. Let my team join your effort. <laughs> What's up the chance for success? I'm offering. You should accept. Very well. I'm not stupid, and I love the Moshi. You're welcome on the mission. Thank you. The team will meet you at our base on Vold. They'll take you to the Get facility. Stay strong and clear. Goodbye. Jal said he wanted to see you. Okay. Where is Jal? Ah, this. This is the mission that I was talking about, friend or foe. Perfect. Where is he? There he is, okay. So, you've gained Ephra's trust. No easy feat. I still don't think he likes me. That's just his way. You should be more worried about the Rokar. Ephra made it seem like you had experience with them. I know their leader. Aksul. We studied together under the Moshai, <laughs> but unlike me, he was a good student. The best, actually. Then he knows about Remnant? He did. <laughs> it's a long story. Give me the short version. Aksul was captured by the Ket. He spent a year in a forced labor camp before he managed to escape. That's why he hates aliens. Yes. He... suffered greatly. When Axul returned, he no longer cared about the Remnant. Or anything. Except destroying the Ket. Why not join the Resistance? Axul's not the type to follow orders. And... I think he was bitter we weren't able to rescue him. So he formed the Rokar. We didn't give them much thought. But since your people arrived, his cause has grown. I convinced Ephra I'm not a threat. Maybe I can do the same with Axul. <laughs> I admire your courage. But Axul's dangerous. And he lacks Ephra's pragmatism. He'll make you want to kill him. I have to try. If Helios is to be your home, I guess you'll have to deal with the Rokar one way or another. There's a recluse on Havarul who escaped with Axul from the Ket. Her name is Thaldir. She might know how to contact him. I'll send you the nerve point. All right, I'll go there right away. Actually, anything else you want to talk to me about? Since we're here? Axul is very cunning. We can't underestimate him. <sighs> My mothers are worried sick about the cousins that joined him. Okay. So let's go back to Havaro.
what if it was Director 10? What if Director 10 killed, uh, uh, Garson? That would be quite a surprise, but he seems too dumb to do it. Okay, let's land. Okay, with us we shall take... Not Liam. No, let's take Drac. We might need him. Entering atmosphere, LZ in sight. Okay, so I would assume it's right over here to the left? Yes. Okay, let's go. Whee! Come on, guys. No time to lose. I'm armored heavily enough to be a threat to anyone, really. Okay, so I can't have my weapons out over here yet. But I can over here, so... Okay, so I do have a uh, profile 4 selected. That's good. Ryder, Thaldea lives near here. She's our best lead to finding Axum. Whoa! It'll take some convincing, but I think so. Let's try it. Defeat the cat. Cat, protect Soldier. How do I enter her home? Through the front door? Rokar. They died fighting. Mm, Aksul must have sent them to watch over Thodir. Container here. Whoa, where the hell did I fall? Far. Or maybe I can just go in through the front door? Duh. Locked. I'll override it. Don't come any closer. 